they call it the Isle of Man is that they don't allow many females on the island. <laughs> Simon, that is the worst joke you have ever heard. <laughs> Hello, it's the rest day. Sun is shining, which is nice. It's nice to have a day off. I'm on my way to see Anna and we're gonna record a video for some new app. Oh, this is the, the playing hole from the last five years. Kind of missed the Villa Marina, but uh, maybe we'll be back someday. Hello. Hi. <laughs> We played through an app, but I can't reveal yet the name of the app. We challenged each other and the little <laughs> issue was the Wi-Fi. We look super focused. Oh, we are, because Fiona wanted to crush me. We're gonna have some cookies now. Mm. And I'm gonna prepare tea for Fiona. <laughs> <laughs> Just left Anna and now I'm stuck with this guy. Yeah. We're on the way to my hotel. Oh yeah. We're gonna join Simon for a short and sexy stream. Sexy being the operative word. Hey, sexy ginger. What's coming? Your boy. Hello. Whoa. Hello. Hello. First question that someone's asked in the chat is: Is Fiona and David married? <laughs> he wishes. Round seven is about to start. Uh, we passed the halfway mark the day after the rest day. Only two leaders on five out of six, Fabiano Carana and Wang Hao. Let's go and check out the side of the round. Oh. Happy birthday. Big shout out to the main man behind Vikonze Tata Steel Chess. Happy birthday. favorite number one. Oh no number one there <laughs> how was yesterday before i go to sleep i wanted to show you something because i'm super 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 excited uh, don't get starstruck very often but earlier today i did when my favorite facebook and twitter and instagram personality followed me it's the one and only Esther the Wonder Pig. Um, I've been following her for a while and so when I saw she following me on Twitter I was like oh my god oh my god oh my god and so actually after she followed me I tweeted at Esther a painting that Alex got me for my 30th earlier this year. Esther got back to me. Esther knows who I am. <laughs> In your career as an arbiter, has it ever happened or anything similar? Have you ever witnessed anything similar? No. I thought that just in the interests of everybody feeling comfortable with the game, yeah. that it was better to just move it into the second hall, then no one can accuse anybody of anything. Sergey, I have never seen anything like this in my life. At which moment did you realize that the board next to you, Shiro, was the same exact uh, position in game? And on board two, we have the big clash, the one that everyone was hoping to see between world champion Magnus Carlsen and world number two, Fabiano Carana, his challenger from last year in London. So things are really heating up, only three rounds to go. And we'll now very soon find out who will get the very coveted spot uh, to the candidates tournament. Here comes the draw king. 
It's only one drawer, yeah? What are you talking about? <laughs> Trying to dethrone our niche. Sebastian, what about the dress code? Since you beat Pusher, has it sunk in yet? Uh, no, I'm still hyperactive. <laughs> Dan is there, like, what's going on? <laughs> and I'm there in the mirror Dan, reflection. How are you about David's win today? How excited? On a scale of 1 to 10, I'm about 12 and a half. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> are you gonna be able to sleep? No. Oh, I'll match the days on, and then I'll sleep, yeah. Liverpool. Oh, I oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. today! Yeah. Liverpool. Liverpool United. Domit Lallana! Goal for Liverpool! Goal for Adam Lallana! Crazy. I, I chatted so much in the interview. <laughs> Tomorrow, hopefully, we'll get another chance. We'll see you then. Good night. <laughs> see you then. <laughs> <laughs> This is it, the last round of the Isle of Man Grand Swiss is about to begin. We're just getting ready here in the studio. Hello, Danny. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, for the first time, incredibly, of the tournament, we have a sole leader. It is Fabiano Caruana who's been playing some incredible chess. And then, of course, there is the candidate spot at stake. Um, I'm obviously cheering for David, who's playing against Wang Hao. And as a commentator, it's very important for me to be absolutely neutral and unbiased. <laughs> so, go Dave! <laughs> <laughs> absolutely, I heard it here first. We're gonna go get ready now and we'll see you later. <laughs> get ready for triumph, failure, delight and disappointment because this is the grand climax of the FIDHS.com Grand Swiss. I wouldn't say it was a great performance. <laughs> <laughs> the, streak, the streak is nice. The performance was mediocre at best. What an achievement for the Chinese Grandmaster and a heartbreaking moment for David Howe to see two different sides of the same coin. Yeah, well, I mean, the disappointment written over David's face. Congratulations, you are our champion of this year. And more importantly, probably for you, you qualify to the candidates tournament. The winner of the FIDE Chess.com Grand Swiss. Wang Hao. Hello. Hello. <laughs> We're here with Eric. Hi. And my least favorite. My thing. favorite, my favorite. Everyone knows. <laughs> Some Jaeger bombs. It's been a tough tournament. You guys are dodging the closing. But not dodging the vlog. <laughs> not that what's more, more important. When is Arian going to be a chess pro? Or is he already? He's, we're, we're having discussions right now. Honorary. The thing is, he, he's <laughs> getting pulled from a lot of different people, so... Too popular. Okay. What's going to happen now? Uh, we're going to get drunk. <laughs> that's very, that's very... Uh, that okay. probably yep. sums it up. That sums it up. 